Hi, welcome or welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time seeing my hands, hi, I'm Erin of Playing Life with Erin, and I'm so excited you stopped by to check out this video. Thanks so much for being here. And if you're returning, hey, hey, how have you been? All right, guys, so this is, it is Monday. It is May 6th. It is the day before Spencer's birthday, technically. I was in labor right now, 10 years ago. Oh my gosh, that's so hard to like even think about. But um yeah, so her birthday's tomorrow. We've already done some of the preparation for her big surprise, which is going to be a new loft bed. Joe is taking the day out of work tomorrow, so we can build said build, uh, loft bed. And I don't know, guys. We have eight hours. I'm hoping we can do it. Um, I have faith. I have faith. So today um, in this video, we are going to be planning in my Sterling Ink, my TN. And let me tell you guys, I love this planner. I've said it, um, I think for the last, what, how many weeks have we been in this planner? Many. We've been in this week. We've been in it. One, two, three, four, five. Six. This is our seventh week in this planner. And I'm still very, very obsessed. But actually, you know what I'm going to do? I want to push this off to the side for a second. But, um, and then we're going to talk about like what we're going to use for stickers and all that stuff because I want to fill my new Twisby, um, eco fountain pen. So I love Twisby. I think they're great. Um, it was recommended to me when I first started off with fountain pens and I'm going to disclaimer this because I am not a fountain pen guru. It is something that I've recently gotten into probably in the last, I don't know, six to eight months maybe. Um, I would love Love, love, love to get um, an, an Esther Brook or um, a Pilot Vanishing um, Point or I love the one that Helen from the Coffee Monster uses, the Leonardo. I think it, it looks beautiful, um, but it's outside my price range and that's okay. So with the Twisby, I find that um, it's very affordable. Um, and I think they write beautifully. So I currently have, this is my third one now. I have this one. I think this one isn't a medium nib, um, or just fine. I think maybe it's a fine. I can't remember. I'd have to look it up. Um, but it's definitely a fine or a medium. I would say it's probably a medium if I had to guess. Then I have this, um, most recent one. I think I did, um, I filled this one, um, on a video. I can't remember which one. This is an extra fine. This is smoke and it has the rose gold on it. And then I got a notification that this one, it is a cafe bronze and I couldn't say no to cafe bronze. So I ended up getting this from, um, Goulet pens, Goulet. I think it's Goulet and not Goulet, but, um, I, actually where I was like watching some videos when I first started with fountain pens um and how to clean them and all that stuff and I stumbled on one of his videos and he happened to have or that that company happened to have this pen available so it is absolutely beautiful it's got um I don't know if it's rose goes I think it's like bronze um for a nib I did get it an extra fine and we're going to be filling it with the <laughs> the ink that I have a hard time pronouncing but this is D <laughs> Atramentis a tremendous there we go something like that um and they have so this is um oh what do you call it i can't it's like a plunge this is the plunger and then it's like just a twist refill and i have to say it's probably the easiest ones that i have to fill um and i really love that i can see how much um ink is getting in there let me see did i push it all the way down okay and then submerge because um my Oh, it's not going to do it, is it? Hold on. There is not a lot of ink left in here because I had an ink catastrophe and I spilled almost all of this. So let me try this again. <laughs> Get it all the way down to the bottom. And then let me tilt it a little bit. So I think that's what needs to be done now since I spilled it. <laughs> I can't believe I did that. Okay, so it's not a full fill, but that's all right. Just need enough for the plan with me and for the next couple of days. And then I will try it in something different. Maybe I'll have to pour it off. So there's like that much left in there. I'm so sad. The day that it happened, um, I was filling my pens. Just want to make sure I got it all off. Um, I was filling quite a few of my pens, actually. I was filling my two Twisbees, and then I was filling my um, 
Mahjong. Where is it actually? Where did I put it? My Mahjong, which I like this pen, but I do feel like the ink doesn't flow very well from the pen. So I typically have my pens kind of like this um, on a slant and a pen holder. Um, and I've noticed that when I keep it flat, it will continue to work. When I put it in my pen holder, it does not. So I've been storing it just upright in another pen holder because I have 5 million of them. Um, I'm going to test it. Yeah, no, there's no ink coming out of it. I'm not sure what's going on with this pen. I do like it. It's very pretty. So maybe one day when I have enough time, I can figure it out. I think that it runs out of ink very quickly because it is a very small chamber. Um, and I do write with it quite a bit when it is flowing. So anyways, we're going to use the Cafe Bronze. I love this. And I, I was going to get it on Jet Pens, but it wasn't available anymore. Wonder Pens didn't have it. So Goulet Pens had it. Um, and I also did the 10 ink sam sampler, um, and I'm going to test that. I don't know when, but I'm going to test it. Maybe we'll do it at my planner check-in. Okay. So we're going to plan for the week of Spencer's birthday. This planner I have been using, I'm going to pull you guys up and over a little bit because I feel like the length of this planner or the height, I should say, I'm not in frame and I feel like... I could just adjust my camera a little bit better and then maybe we can be in frame and I don't have to worry about it so much. But I've been using this just as like little lists and stuff. Um, so far, I think last week was my favorite. Um, I'm still not sure about the headers, although I do feel like it seems weird without one. So I'm not sure. We might divide this out a little bit and just kind of have it be like my important things or that's like the next thing to do, like just divide it into three sections. So we'll see where this is gonna take us. Um, I was thinking about using this lovely washi tape from the washi tape shop. I really like this. I think it's kind of fun and playful for um, a spread for Spencer's birthday. Um, there is also this one that has some like little um, accent pieces maybe that we can add in. Although I do really like this girl. So we'll see, we're gonna play around with it. I think I'm gonna lean towards this one and just kind of do these few girls. So let's cut this off. And I apologize, I don't know the name of this washi tape, but I will link it down below. And I do have a code, it's Planning Erin 10. If you use it with the washi tape shop, you will save 10% on your order. Um, I actually need to, I would like to put in an order for the washi tape shop because they just came out with like um, a bundle that just looks really, really cute. And I've been watching um, a lot of um, I guess like art journaling and like doing Dutch doors and I'm like, Ooh, and it would be perfect for Dutch doors. So I want to, I'm thinking about getting that. All right. So how do we want to lay this out guys? I don't even know. Um, I was watching website did it again and I like how she laid it out, but I, I haven't watched it enough and I haven't played around with it, which is kind of nice. Like, so this, I didn't start this until the end of March, but it's nice because I have these blank layouts back, back here so I can play around with it. So we're just going to kind of play around with mine right now like just what I'm thinking I'm gonna do today so I'm gonna grab my pencil and this is a Tombow mechanical pencil it is in a 0.5 um, which is so hilarious because I don't normally uh, like mechanical pencils but I decided to give this one a try Joe is always trying to talk me into using a mechanical pencil for years because he loves them and I'm like ew no but I do like this one, I will say. And a lot of my doodling has been done with this pencil. So maybe it's just been the kind that I've used in the past. I don't know. So I think I'm just gonna divide it out into threes for now. That is not straight. Let's try that again. But I think that the way I'm gonna do it is we're just gonna have three sections. One for home things for now, one for my hobbies and things, and then a section for planning life with Erin things. Ooh, okay, well, we'll see how this works out. All right, so first of all, I do like this fairy, so I think I wanna use this one first. And I kinda wanna put her here and like have her fall off the page a little bit. So let's go with this one. I was gonna use a different set. Um, so I, I have many washi tapes from the washi tape shop. I really love their their tapes and their washi stickers like this one. Um, but when it comes to the 
some of them I have to cut them and this is my third plan with me today so I kind of wanted to just take it easy and just have an easy plan with me today um oh, I love this girl I kind of want her to be in the cozy hobby section because I think she just reminds me of me especially when I'm sitting I can't say all the cats sit on me but I don't want to attach this to a tab by accident. But we've got Bo that likes to hang out on my lap, Prue that likes to hang out on my lap, and like Prue just kind of gave up and she just lays there with Bo now too. So I think this is very appropriate. And I typically have headphones on when I'm gaming or just doing cozy hobbies and things like that. All right, so I do like this girl. How would she be in the middle? She's kind of cute. I like her too, but I feel like she'd need to be, unless we do it this way, that might not be bad. And bring it over. Hmm. I think so. I think we'll use this one. I like the colors and it kind of reminds me of the colors. Not, not exactly, but the purple that's in there reminds me of what we're doing in Spencer's room. That's cute. These are so cute. All right. I don't want to cut off my tab. I love Mondays. I was thinking that I've had a really, I've had a really stupid morning, but, um, and it was just like little things. Like I dropped the mail and I might be very repetitive if you see my other plan from me, but I dropped the mail. Um, I had to figure out how to get that. And then we had like an unexpected bill for, uh, Spencer's MRI. I was not expecting the cost of it, but here we are. Um, so I was kind of feeling like overwhelmed and just like, ah, and then I sat down and I opened up my Hobonichi cousin and I've been planning for the last, I don't know, like two, three hours. And I have to say, I really enjoy planning. Like I really do. And it helps with a lot of things. It helps with my, my mental, um, my mental health and just, you know, kind of, what is that noise? I think it's a cat. Okay, she must be like attacking a bug or something. It just helps me with um, with getting everything out of my head onto paper. So I took a little bit of time this morning to do um, a budget because I'm still working on that. We've had one. I've said this in another video. Um, we're okay with budgeting, but um, sometimes it's really hard to budget when you don't have the funds to do so. So trying to like trim some more fat and things like that off of what we've already, I mean, we're already at bare minimum. So, um, but like that helped. It was kind of like, oh, you know, let me do this. And I avoid it. It's something on the procrastination list. But um, in the end, I am feeling better. And between that and doing my planning, I'm feeling pretty good today. And also it helps that the sun came out. <laughs> So that's always good. How does this one go this way? Put that one over there since she had like the birds with her. This is so cute. I love this fox. He's with him. So maybe we can add him in somewhere like for Weston. I feel like right. I'm just going to add in the little pieces and then we'll get to that. All right. So we'll do these butterflies. This is so cute. I don't think I've used this roll yet, actually. I might have just swatched it. But it's so pretty. Maybe I'll do this one down here like that. And then we'll do another one over here. This pink one. Maybe we can fit in two. Hmm. Let's do this one. So the sun came out, it was dreary and yucky, and now the sun came out, so it's a little bit nicer out. Um, and it's warm, it's getting warm. So that's always nice. Ooh, that's cute. Okay, let's work on the cozy hobbies. Got a reading book, and there's a cat sleeping. I like this reading book, let's use this one. I don't know why I'm like turning things upside down. I don't mind. It's the weekend. I haven't been using this planner on the weekend a little bit. I have just to like make some notes, but oh, as I drop my tweezers, 
Let's see, what else do we wanna use here? And we've got this whale. Can we fit this little baby whale in? Let's see if we can fit this one in. Maybe like that. That looks good. And I have a section down here, so maybe, what do we wanna do here? I like the girl with the flamingo. I think that's kind of cute. But maybe we could put her up here and kind of, oh, that looks good. Where like the flamingo's head goes over the 12 for the 12. It is Mother's Day. So we might be able to put a Mother's Day something down there or some quotes. I do have a couple of Happy Planner books that I have right next to me. I've been on a little bit of a Happy Planner kick. So, all right, let's see. How do we want to do this? Do I like that? Hmm. I'm going to kind of keep it. I'm not going to push it down all the way. These are washi tapes, so they should come up. I do like this boy because I like the fox. We could put him in the middle. All right, let's try that. Or we could put him right here, kind of half in the middle. And then the fox next to him, because I really like this fox. Okay, do I like that there? I still don't know. I have not decided. All right. So a couple of Happy Planner books I actually just got for myself, which it's odd because I have not bought, I was, if you are new here, um, I started off, I'm just going to put that down. If I don't like it, I'll pull it up. Um, I started off as a happy planner <laughs> and, um, then I made the switch over to Hobonichi. I found my planner piece and my Hobonichi, um, cousin. And, um, it's funny because I've been, I always watch, um, plan with me's happy planner plan with me's cause I have some friends that I like to watch and like just in general, and I saw somebody with this book the other day. I'm like, oh my gosh, it has mushrooms in it. I need to have it. So that's how we ended up with this. Um, let's see. Make life wonderful. Oh, I like that. I kind of like how it's gold. It's on paper. Let's see if we have any. Not on paper. I think I saw some in the back. Do what makes you happy. Oh, I like that. Let's see. Seasons change, keep going, keep growing. So this one is, what is this one called? Woodland Seasons. I, I didn't even know the title of it. I was like, mushrooms. I'm like all about mushrooms right now, which is so funny. Um, oh, here we go. Do what makes you happy and it is clear. Do what makes you happy. It's funny because this was like one of those things that When I was in the 90s, we had mushroom. I had mushrooms everywhere. Um, and like Spencer's been like looking or uh, drawing mushrooms with eyes on them. And she told us the other day that it's weird core, I guess. I don't know. Um, I think it's funny because we were using it when I was in, gosh, I was probably a little bit older than Spencer. I think I want to use this here. Or do I want to put it up here? Kind of cuts into my Friday a little bit, but I think think. No, I don't want to put it across the flamingo. All right, we'll do it down here. I stuck it down by accident. Let's try to do it straight. Ooh, that's cute. I like that. And then maybe I can find something small for up here. Um, yeah, so she said it was weird core, and I'm like, that's so funny. I was like, we used to, we used to have, um, Eyeballs on things when I was in the when I was in the nineties too. I was probably like in fifth grade. Funny, funny. Dream big. That's pretty. This book is. I'll tell you in a second. I got this one from Michaels the other day. They were having a sale and I couldn't say no. This one is, um, breathe, live, explore. Breathe, live, explore. Yeah. Okay. This one's cute. Dream big. I like that. I'm trying to keep it like kind of in the gold scheme. Usually I've been doing a lot of black letter, a lot of black words lately. So I kind of like doing the gold. Let's see what else we got. I've already used it a couple of times. Um, full of heart. Bloom bright, smile. Oh, I like that. 
I want to do something for this, like down here, if I can, like a straight line, if I can find something. And if I can't, that's okay. Sometimes there are, I don't think there is in this book, like little strips with like, let's see, focus on, remember, breathe, no. All right, I have one other one that I can look in, and this one, where'd it go? Oh, here it is. I have a pile of stuff over here. I've been planning all day, so my desk is a hot mess, and I love it. It's a beautiful mess, that's what I like to say. Such a good day. Goals. Um, those are colors. I don't want colors. This book that I'm flipping through right now, I'll tell you the name when I get through it. Um, Self-care time. Too bad that wasn't in like a, a gold. Think happy, be happy. No. I love these. I'm saving this page, though. I don't know what I'm saving it for, but I'm saving it because I love these mushrooms. Okay. I don't see what I want, so maybe this is good for now. We'll just check in here one more time. That one was, this one is Painted Blossoms. This was what I've based my cozy corner on, like a lot of the colors and the theme. I'm really into llamas. I like the furry cows, mushrooms, all the things. So I guess after talking to Spencer... My, um, do what makes you happy? Is this attached to the sticker? It is. Oh, but maybe we can add a mushroom in here. Mm, I'll take up too much room. So after talking to Spencer, come to find out, I guess. Well, that one's nice. Fill your head with dreams and your heart with wonder. Maybe I can put it there. Hmm. All right, we'll put we'll put a pin on that one for a second. Um, I am apparently into cottage core, which I didn't realize it was cottage core, but okay. I do like this fall in love with life. That one's nice, but it's gonna take up too much of my Friday. So that's not gonna work. What's this one? Enjoy the moment that makes you slow down. Ooh, that one's perfect. We'll use that one. Okay. Hooray for happy planner. We can put this right down here. Actually, I think I might. Actually, you know what? It's good. Right there. I like that. Okay. Oh, I like this. It's pretty. Okay. So, I did kind of block off Monday a little bit with my big whale over here. I wasn't I wasn't thinking about that. But, um, I'm going to... My cats are freaking me out. I thought somebody was just knocking at my door. They're not. It was Willow. Hi, Willow. <laughs> Okay, so how do I want to do this? First of all, let's pull some colors. I'm like still finding my way around this, so bear with me. Oh, I wasn't actually telling you to come up here, but hello. Happy to see you here. Um, we're going to keep the colors neutral since there's already a lot of other colors. Look, have you guys seen Willow? I don't know. She doesn't normally come up here. She's, she, she's weird. She likes me, but she doesn't like me. I don't think there's room for you up here, Mama. Oh, you can't have those. I have like all my... Um, scraps stuck over here. I wanted to eat them. No. All right, she's down. I don't want to add too many colors. So I like these colors. I think they'll go. How do I want to do this though? I'm trying to get away from adding more color in. So you know what? We're not going to do that. We're going to. Can I move this over? I'm just going to cut that off. But let's see. Hold on. I didn't even realize it when I did it. Unfortunately, it would have been better if I realized it. And this should, whoops, this should come off. Might get a little wrinkly, but I have others, so it's okay. We'll move it over. I think when I was originally putting it down, I was thinking, uh oh. Oh, I was tearing this, that washi tape. Okay, Whew, we did it. Let's, I might have to get a fresh one. I think we could save it. 
And let's move her over a little bit so I have some space. Even just down here is fine. Oh, and I stuck to all my tabs. Do we like that like that? Oh, now it's on that tab. Oh, goodness. Problems, guys. Let's figure this out. I have a sticker stuck to my finger that's making it so I can't do what I want to do. I just need to make sure I have a little bit of space. Oh, that's too high. Maybe do we just put it down here, call it a day. I might just get another one. Cause this one's getting a little too wrinkly for me. All right, let's try it again. This is the Monday I've been having, but I'm not gonna let this get me down. <laughs> Let's try that again. So I want to make sure I have some space on Monday. So she'd have to be somewhere like that. So let's cut because I don't want to cut my tab. So I'm just gonna make this flat. So bad. I feel like I'm cutting off the seaweed, but maybe I'll salvage the seaweed. Hold on. Let's see what we can do here. Just a little tiny bit. That's all I need. Just a little space. All right, and let's do let's cut this off. Actually, let's do it a little bit higher. Or We'll do it this way. Her hand's in there, so it's kind of throwing me off. I don't want her hand in there. What other scraps do I have? You know what? I think I'm going to not do that part. Because if I put it here, I cover the five for May, which I don't know if I care too much about. You know what? We're just going to do that. All right, that's fine. Crisis averted. I'm glad that I decided to try to write. So this way I can see that I messed up. Okay. Let me make sure this is working properly. It is. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay. So we have my morning routine. So what I was doing last week was I did my top three. Um, I do like that, but... I don't know where I'm going to put that. So maybe we just do the top three up here. Do I have enough room? I have room here and here. No. We're going to section it off. We're doing it different than we did last week. Okay. So for my personal stuff, I have to, I have to do my dishes. I have some breakfast dishes still. Dishes. I want to finish up the budget. Um, and I need to call the insurance company. Okay. So that is for today. Um, and then we are, this is going to be my cozy section because of this girl. So we'll do, um, we need to film. We're going to edit. I need my glasses when I use this planner. I think my eyes just haven't adjusted to the lightness of these boxes. I could have wrote it here. Oh well. And I think that's all I have to do there. So I would like to game. I think Joe and I have some plans to game later. And I want to work on my diamond painting. And maybe paint by number. We'll put that in there. I think I want to put over here a walk. Something that I would like to get done today. If I can, I have some time. So I might be able to go for a quick walk.
Okay, I'm not sure if I like this. So tomorrow's a new day. Maybe tomorrow morning when I get up, I'll have a different idea. I don't know. It's like I want to just use it as a planner. So maybe I should just use it as a planner and say, okay, this is what I'm going to do from this time to this time. I do like how this layout came out, though. I do like the the way that the washi looks and the and all that. So I think I just need to figure out um, a little bit better what I need to do. Like maybe make this section smaller and have it just be the top three and then start my decorating from there down. I don't know. Either way, it still works. It's still kind of basically what I've been doing, which works really well. Um, and then, what else? I wanted to do something else here. Oh, I know what I need to do. I need to answer some emails. Answer emails and go through the PR stuff. Okay, All right, so that's good. I'm sure more things will come up for the home things, but this is nice. I really like how this came out and I have a section over here. I wonder if I want to use it as a goal section or something. I'm not going to touch it for right now. I'm going to leave it for now, but I do like this. Oh, I got ink. Where did that come from? How did the ink get there? Hmm. Did it come out of my pen? Hope not. Nope, I don't think it came from the pen. Maybe when I was doing something before, I don't know. Hopefully it didn't come out of the pen. Nope, I don't know. I probably dripped it before and didn't even realize it. Okay, so I have ink on my desk now <laughs> that I definitely have to clean up, um, but that's okay. I actually tip, I don't know, maybe people know this, but I have like a, um, a mouse pad mat down on my desk and when I spilled, um, over half of my bottle of ink and went everywhere and Joe was like oh no and I'm like I could buy a new one they're like ten dollars I didn't want to but I was more concerned about losing my ink but we used a little bit of Windex and a magic erase and it came right off like this was the the place of the spillage and it came off completely so I'm going to do that method again to get these drops off. I don't know if you guys can see them. I think they're off camera. They're over here. But it looks like I just took a pen and just like made like a splash art. All right. I think I want to run in Spencer's birthday. Um, I do like it. I like that. Let's write it in down here maybe. Make life wonderful. I don't know. I don't know if I want to write it in like that. I do want to write in the things that we're doing tomorrow, though. So tomorrow we are building the bed. I'm going to set up her room. I have to get a card. And get balloons. And I actually want to add in here, um, look for wrapping paper. I was saying, I don't know if I said it in this one. I think I said it in my last plan with me. I would like to see if, um, if I have wrapping paper downstairs, I'm just gonna like wrap some boxes and then put them out for her so she thinks those are her gifts because she already saw an Amazon box in my room. And she's like, is that my present? I'm like, I don't know, maybe. And she's like, no, really? Do you not know? Is it my present? And I'm like, I'm not telling. But I wanna kinda like throw her off and like if she sees presents maybe on the table that she can unwrap. I don't know. I'm really excited to let you guys know how everything worked out. It is Monday, it is May 6th. So I filmed three of my videos. Um, today just because I like to have my planners ready. I'm a Monday morning planner. That's partly why I like Mondays. Um, but I will be doing a planner check-in probably on Friday this week. So I will definitely be able to check in and let you know how everything was. Um, and if I can, I will take a picture and I will share it up in the community post. So be on the lookout for that if you're interested in checking that out. And I think that is going to do it for me for this one. I really like this. Like I said, um, this was from the washi tape shop. I will link it down below because I honestly can't remember what the name of the, um, 
I think it was a set. So I can't remember what it was, but I will link it down below. And um, as always, you can use my um, my code, Planning Erin10, the wash tape shop. It'll save you 10% um, off anything you order. So everything will be linked down below. So don't worry. If you didn't hear what I had to say, check down below in the description. It's all there for you. And as always, thank you so much for taking time out of your day to come and plan with me. I really appreciate it. I know we're all busy. So thank you. Thank you. And until I see you again, have a beautiful week and keep planning. Bye.